welcome to Lisex Creations. Now, before I like to start this video, as I always start with an apology, I really want to apologize that I have been MIA this um, past holiday. I've just been really busy with finals and um, work in general because, you know, holiday seasons are always the busiest. And yeah, I've just been super tired, so I just like times I want to sleep so I do apologize for that so since that have been said happy belated new year and I wish you guys are having an awesome year it's still January um and yeah so as you can tell by the title of this video it's gonna be like a quick um show of my makeup collection that I got here going on um it's I'm not here to brag I just want to share with you what I have and you know if you guys have the same product as me you know and I don't do a review about it let me know how you um, like about the product that I'm about to show you so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video and let's get started okay so I'm gonna start off with my Hello Kitty five piece brush set um, I never did use this yet and I did mention this in my I think it's October haul or November. I probably will never use it. I just want to keep it in there if anything. Let's move on. These drawers right here is just plastic drawers that I got at Walmart. They come in threes as you can see it's detached from each other. These are like seven bucks each. Remember? So first drawer is eyeshadows. Um, eyeshadows from Victoria's Secret to Maybelline and YX and then Girl Sephora and back here is by Shiseido it's their cream on my shadows got it as a sample and yeah uh, these are just the individuals that I just have second drawer is my favorite drawer these are all my loose um, pigment eyeshadows uh, got actually all of this back in like 2009 and I still have them this is the um, by Mac. Uh, this one is by the it's the Christmas edition. I don't know if they have this anymore, but I got both of them. The warm, uh, the earth tones, warm tones on the bottom. Uh, this one is uh, glitter, and this one is also glitter. This one is the teal one. That um, teal, yeah. It's um, transparent. And this one is very pink and it's the reflect. And this one is a nice champagne color. Love this. This is shimmer time. And this one is violet. Very super pigmented. Uh, this one is my NYX right here. They're loose um, eyeshadows. That one is Jessie Girl. Back in the back uh, right there. The green and the pink one right there. Back right there it's um, NYX too. And this one is Makeup Forever. This one is my personal favorite. This is Star Powder. Or that's what it's called. Actually, it's more of a number for Makeup Forever. This is my nice champagne um, shimmer color. And this is a lovely gold color. Next drawer is Lips. These ones are by CoverGirl. Uh, this is not my favorite. Actually, this one is my favorite right here. Oh, this one. It's called um, Heavenly. A really nice um, soft pink color. You think it's really dark by the color, but it's not. Goes on very neutral. I do have my vibrant and my nudes. These are MAC um, lip glosses, lip um, lipsticks, and these are Victoria's Secret. This one right here in the back um, is my personal favorite. It's cold. Them. Yes, and come to find out they're not going to sell any of the Victoria's Secret cosmetic line here in Hawaii. I don't know if it's throughout whole, um, the United States, but they're not going to sell them anymore. I don't know why. Uh, these are my foundations, MAC, both MAC here. Uh, this is the Hello Kitty, Hello Kitty collection by MAC. This is a MAC blush right here. This is um, Ding. Maybelline Sephora. Uh, these ones I hardly use. I just have it because it's there. 
Uh, this one is my miscellaneous drawer, my Urban Decay professional size um, primer potion. They still sell these. You can get it at Sephora. Uh, just the white paint that I use for Halloween and my project for speech because I did a geisha look. Um, cosmetics glitter in the back. Just random jumbo pencils. This one is by Sephora. These are the old packaging, so I don't use it. Uh, Victoria's Secret Mascara. This is the extra lengthening mascara. I used it a couple times in one of my videos. And this is my second favorite um, drawer. One because it's fussy. These are from Japan. This is also this is from Forever 21. I got this back in 2009. Never did use them because they're so beautiful. Makeup Forever. We were supposed to do a black swan look for work, but didn't get to use it. These are the feather ones. You can get that so far. Red cherries right over here, and more of um, Japan's eyelashes. Next, let's move on to palettes. Um, these palettes in the back don't really care for. Just have it because it's there. Uh, these two right here is my new favorite palette. The Beach Cosmetics um, 28 color palette. This is the neutral eyeshadow palette. Oops, sorry. And this is the contour and blush palette. And the good thing about this is that if you're starting off, like I mentioned when I did give them um, all about these two, it's really good to have um, when you start off because it's just it comes in with every color. These are really good for bridal or graduation or stuff like that. This is the BH Cosmetics 120 color eyeshadow palette. This is the third edition. It's more of the more of the vibrant colors. It comes with a neutral palette also. This is my MAC. Um, hardly use this now. One because I have all of these colors, but I still use it um, from time to time. This is my Tarte. Uh, never did use this yet. I'm waiting to experiment with this. Uh, this is the neutral eye palette. It comes like this. These ones I think is 48. You can get these at Sephora. But their cosmetics line is super good. I really like it. Uh, and they come with their eyeshadow primer one. This is also good too. And this is the um, 15 color palette by Beach Cosmetics. This is a pro palette. This one you personalize yourself. You can um, these are all matte actually. There's no shimmer. So you can go on beachcosmetics.com. You can actually um what is that? You can create your own palette. Uh, this is my Tokidoki palette. Never did open it yet, but it's their Christmas collection for this year, I believe. Never did open it, but don't want to yet. And it comes with a little cute chain right here. This one is their Midnight Glamour. This was, I think, back in 2011, early 2011, or ending of 2010. I believe. Not too sure, but it's really dark midnight colors. This is my favorite, the Tuscan Blood Orange. It smells super good in color, and I do have my Fix Plus by Mac right over here. Just use it from time to time and stuff. And let's move on to brushes. I have my brush, face brush here, and blush brush. My eyes to eyebrows brush right over here and foundation brushes. And yeah. Um, if you see these ones, these are probably pretty cute. Can you get these online? Um, these one, I think I got it for a really good price for fifty dollars. Um, the thing about these, though, when you first get them, uh, it sheds a little. It doesn't shed like a lot, but it just sheds a little. So you just have to keep a little bit like washing them from time to time to stop the shedding and stuff. Um, just a hairspray right over here. This is my foundation, liquid foundation. This is my all-time favorite Makeup Forever HD foundation. Super good. Sephora collections right over here. Um, MAC. And I have different shades because I usually get tan if I go out and play on the side. My dual eyeshadow glue, favorite all time. And this is the Revlon um, liquid eyes uh, liquid foundation. This is the 
01 color. I use this for my porcelain doll um, makeup tutorial. And their Victoria's Secret um, face primer. This is my benefit. This is their eyebrow kit. I love this product. This one has wax in this one. And it has the powder on this side. It helps the color on your hair stay in place. I like this. And it comes with tweezers and your eye brush, um, your eyebrow brush thingy. Oh, and I have one more thing in here. The Victoria's Secret Concealer. I did mention that I didn't like it because if you keep it out in the cold, it actually gets hard very easily. Um, eyebrow, um, eyebrow, eyelash curler right here. Um, these products right here is from Sephora. This one is the First Aid Beauty um, Restore Cream. But this is like the anti-wrinkling, uh, so like it prevents wrinkles in the future. This is by um, Hope. Actually, it's by Philosophy, I think. Yes, Philosophy. Um, these ones are super cool, actually. I saw when I got these, I was just like, wondering what the hell is. But it comes in um, little cute, um, con little cute uh, plastic containers like this. And all you do is you rip off this part right here. And there's liquid in here to moisturize your hand and um, hydrate your skin. This one is the firming and tightening cream. Um, these are another super good if like under your eyes it starts to sag. This will be here is all my eyeliners, my um, jumbo pencils, and lip liners. Uh, all my lip liners is by NYX, NYX. Um, eyeliners are all Sephora, and jumbo pencils, there's uh, my milk here, and right back here is my MAC, and this one is by Sephora. Uh, this here is all my liquid uh, glitter gel liners, liquid liners, not gel liners. Uh, this one is Revlon, just used to touch up whenever there's eyelash glue. Uh, this one is my eyeliner um, brush. This one um, is the Sephora, um, what's it called? The Sephora Deluxe Clear Brush Set. This back here is my everyday use from blushes to um, foundation uh, to concealer. It's my everyday lip gloss. This is by um, Sir Secret. It's called Innocent. Uh, MAC Paint Pot and Painterly and my NC20 concealer. This one is, I got a sample from Kat Von D. This one is in tan, it's her tattoo concealer. Uh, this is the um, matte foundation, the powder foundation from um, Sephora. This is NYX blush, this is Desert Rose. Pinky is right here, and my favorite is Cafe. Um, this basket right here is all the new products that I recently got. Uh, I'm not going to go through with this, um, I'm going to try it out first and I'll let you guys know or I'll just do a separate video for this. But I just want to introduce this, um, this is the Yves Saint Laurent Shocking Mascara. Love this part, it really smells good. Is it weird that I said it smells good? Because it does. This is Shocking. Um, there's Yves Saint Laurent in here, Bare Minerals, Philosophy, Sephora, Lips to Eyeshadows, and Stila. Oh, it's Peter Thomas. And Peter Thomas Roth, I think it's called. Yeah. Peter Thomas Roth. It's, um, Lashes to Dry For Liner. This, I'm still using it. It's kind of like a week's process to see results. But this eyeliner is supposed to help your lashes grow. That is what I have. Oh, and this is by Smith's. This is their Strawberry Lip Balm. Um, in this drawer right here, I just have my falsies. This one um, is by model21eyelashes.com, as you can see. This I will probably forever buy from them. They never let me down. It ranges. Whatever design you have or like whatever, um, however thick you go, the, the prices range from that. And these ones right here are, I think, was like under $10, like, and they come in 10 pairs. If you can see, it goes in there. And these ones um, are super good to have, especially when you do bridal. 
I would recommend this website. And they are, I did a, a video of me showing Model 120, uh, Model 21 eyelashes haul. And these ones, the old packaging was like in the orange um, box. And this one is super cute because they changed the packaging and it has um, a girl right here. So chic. And my Hello Kitty stuff, my um, circle lenses case, my Hello Kitty perfume, her hair clip. And back here is um, the, you know, the brushes that I have with the pink tips. Um, these ones, and this is the brush holder case. And that's it. So this is my makeup collection. Nothing much, really. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you.